Hey everybody. So I've been studying, but I'm getting kind of tired. So I'm taking a break and I'm going to show you around my house. Sounds good. But well, we got to start outside. So I'm going to go outside and we'll start there. Okay. So this is where I live. Actually, I live right there, but I'm going to turn around. Okay. So I live there in the international house. So most of the international students live here, but not all. Some of them live over there in that dorm, but I live here. There's girls on this side and then boys over there. So now I'm gonna flip the camera and we're gonna head inside. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I've got my camera flipped. I know I've said yeah a lot. I don't know what's up with that. I'm sorry about the shaky cam, but I gotta walk. So, you know, I'm not the best walker. Um, anyway, so I live here. Nobody's home right now. They're all at class. I'm the only one home, which is why I chose right now to film because I was like, I don't know if everybody's gonna be cool with that. So kind of just sort of it. Sorry about my finger. Um, to get in, I've got to put in my passcode and um, scan my hands. Hold on. Okay, and then I just stick my hand in here. It reads the like the veins on the top of your hand, which I think is cool. This is my, my mailbox. It has no mail in it, sadly. It will though. I feel like I have some on the way, so I'm gonna head up to the sixth floor because that's where I live. There's me. Hi, me. Um, yeah, sixth floor. Um, actually, this elevator is pretty cool. It has buttons over here and buttons over here. Um, most elevators in Korea do. Um, these are for people in wheelchairs, or if you've got a bunch of people in the elevator, you can't reach all the way, you know, over here, you can use these ones. So that's pretty cool, I think. Um, actually, these ones don't work for whatever reason. Like they don't, they don't go anywhere, which is frustrating because I press them every time. Anyway, <laughs> all right. Um, elevator buttons, here's the thought. It was cool. So another button block that I've got to... Okay, so I have the door open now and I'm gonna head into my suite, um, yeah. So this is the first part, it's where all the shoes are. Um, you have to take your shoes off when you come inside. We have an awesome little shoe closet where everybody keeps their shoes. Uh, the door's mad at me. Okay, <laughs> so I have to take my outside shoes off really quickly, hold on. Uh, shoes. <sighs> okay, <laughs> anyway, so this is the common area. It's where we have our clothes drying racks. We have a little table, we have it pushed up in the wall, but sometimes we pull it out and eat at it. Um, our little fridge that we share. This is our little like veranda. We have all our suitcases and stuff out there. We dry clothes out there. Actually, it's a pretty cool view. I think I'll head out there. Uh oh, sorry. I hit a drying rack. Um, <laughs> but yeah, you can kind of see campus. There's all the little people down there. So all of these buildings you see are dormitories, dormitory, dormitory, dormitory. There's 14 dormitories at this school. It's huge huge school um it's like the number fifth biggest school i think in korea so pretty pretty big pretty awesome um yeah so i'm gonna close all this back don't want the cold and the bugs in um anyway so yeah Wah. sorry if you get dizzy watching this video i am sorry so we have our our food in there only a little bit of that is mine those are my strawberries and those are my carrots but that's and my cheese <laughs> that's, that's all that's fine everything else is other people's but um so three rooms share this common area so six so oh, one two and one one two and three um a korean and a chinese girl live there a korean and american girl live there not me and then i live here in the middle room um my roommate's boyfriend got this for her they, um, he went to the army last week, so she was really sad they went on a trip together. Before he went, it was really fun, um, so I got the room to myself. So this is my room. It's tiny, but it's mine. Sorry, it's a little bit messy. I just got in from class um, a couple hours ago, and I just was doing homework. So this is my little desk area. My computer, my school books, all my stuff on all my shelves, and... Over here, you know, is the door again, and then my closet. I keep all my clothes. I finally have hangers. I bought hangers over the weekend, so my clothes are hung up. All right. Uh, yeah. 
Okay, so back in the living room, I'm gonna show you our little bathroom that we share. We share with the room, the suite of three rooms next door. Um, so all in all, there are 12 girls that share this bathroom area. Yeah, sorry, I'm super awkward. I've gotta put on my, my bathroom shoes. Um, the reason you have to put on more shoes <laughs> is because um, the shower is drained directly into the floor, so sometimes the floor is wet. But yeah, this is, we've got two little showers. We've got our three toilet stalls. We have heated toilet seats. That's pretty cool, I think. I mean, it's really nice, especially when it's cold. And then here's our bathroom veranda, which has our washing machine that we share with these two rooms. And they call this thing a dryer, but that's not actually what it does. It just spins your clothes. So like it spins the water out, sort of like a salad spinner, but for clothes. <laughs> yeah. So cool. I don't know really what else to say. That's that's pretty much everything. So yeah, I'm back in my room now. Um, I've got to get back to studying. I've got a test tomorrow that I have to study for. And yeah, I think that's it. So I hope you enjoyed my sort of super short, crazy, small <laughs> house. Uh, dormitory, dormitory tour, and yeah.